This week's Tech Savvy Tip is on Google Profiles. Hello everyone, this is Mike and I wanted to talk about a little feature that you may not be aware of that can save you a ton of time uh, both for yourself and for your students. And that is switching between Google Profiles in Google Chrome. So what you're looking at right now is I'm logged in um, as NCCE uh, to a profile and the way to switch back and forth between multiple profiles is to go to the upper right hand corner of your window, uh, click in the window and you can see that I have a ridiculous amount of profiles listed here but here's the magic of profiles. Um, if I click on my personal profile or mic, notice how my screen looks totally different. I have a totally different set of Google extensions installed uh, at the top of my Chrome browser and not only that but I have all my bookmarks saved under my personal profile. That's completely different from um, this NCCE profile I have. This is a great way if you have multiple Google accounts, which most of us do at this point, uh, to keep yourself organized in windows um, specific to the activities that you're doing. For instance, personal uh, email, I can pull up uh, and go to all my personal bookmarks and such. Um, for NCCE activities, I have a completely diff different screen and setup. So for you, if you want to try, it's as easy as clicking on the uh, profile button again in the upper right hand corner and look for uh, the uh, manage people uh, option. When you click manage people, it's going to ask you literally to add a person. And let's set up my uh, 500th Google account profile. Pick the alien person for fun. And then the key is I need to set up sync, right? Turn on sync and now it's going to ask, well, what Google account is this associated with? So then I type in um, my Google account uh, and my password. And once I'm set up and logged in, I will have another uh, profile set up that's unique um, for Google extensions, bookmarks, all of that. So that's Google Profiles. Thanks so much for watching.